So folks, uh, every once in a while we like to dive into the, I don't really know what to call it other than the concerning side of America, the side of America that you just look at and you say, um, what are we doing? Is this real? Do my kids have to be a part of this, right? Just normal people thoughts. But the other day there was a woman, uh, I, th I think it's a man. Ultimately, who gives a sh what matters is what they're saying. So why don't we just go into it and then we'll break it down. We'll, we'll look at some of the awesome comments on it because that's half the reason why I even go on Instagram anymore. It has become the most savage place. I mean, the comment sections on it, they're almost as savage as mine. And for those of you who don't know, I read through most of the comments on here. I take my time and it's super fun for me. And yes, y'all are savage as and I love it. So why don't we watch this and then we'll we'll break it down here. Not to be like overly dramatic or anything, can we just start stabbing transphobes at this point? Like we have such a big problem of transphobic people being fucking idiots and not getting their shit kicked in. Can we just start kicking their shit for everyone? Every The entire world would be so much better if we could just stab a transphobe. You say something transphobic, you get stabbed. The world would be beautiful. <laughs> okay. A lot of points to bring up here. Uh, first of all, can we just take a second to, I don't know, check out what this dude has hanging off of his glasses? Oh, that's nice. You're into astrology? It's like when those girls ask you on the first date, oh, what's your sign? Who gives a fuck? Can we stand each other for like a coffee? Can we talk to each other and not want to kill each other? Okay, that's what matters, not what sign they are. I had some chick tell me that the other day and I just had no response. My sign? My sign is to leave right now. Anyways, I do want to say what would happen if a, I don't know, a Trump person said something like this? What if a Trump person went on social media and said, well, we just need to stab everyone involved with the letter community? I imagine that person would one, be banned from that app, two, they would probably be arrested for hate speech. And three, they would probably be prosecuted because most likely the DA is a part of that community. So there's a lot of companies out there nowadays who promote being pro-America, whatever it may be. There's a reason why I've had blackout coffee on this channel for as long as I have. Truly an American-based company, they only source the best beans. My favorite by far is Brutal Awakening, I'm the dark roast kind of guy. But just like the last time we talked about it, Blueberry Crumble, oh man. So we're putting a discount code below the video. Go show them some support and grab some amazing coffee. You say something transphobic, you get stabbed. The world would be beautiful. Now I want to be clear on something. These people do not scare me. Transphobes is a word that I've never understood. You don't scare me or anyone else for that matter. I don't care that you were born a gender and that you're trying to tell everyone else that you're something else. Isn't it weird how they're trying to convince everyone else that they're a certain gender? Why can't you just be yourself. What does it matter what other people think? You guys didn't think about that, did you? Okay. But I don't care what you guys do. I have no control over it. I'm not gonna let myself get upset over other people's actions. But what I will say is that when you insert yourself into people who just don't buy into your delusion and say some crap like this, that's when we're gonna get in your face about it. So why don't we just Start with that. So for those of you who are new, the veterans here know exactly what I'm about to say, but I'm a bit of a smart ass. So of course I commented on this video and said stabbing transphobes sounds kind of gay. Just saying. Not to be like overly dramatic or anything, can we just start stabbing transphobes at this point? Like we have such a big problem of transphobic people being It does, stabbing has a lot of meaning. So what are you saying? Now, let's move to the next point. Who do you think the people that you're describing transphobes are? Most likely, people who believe in traditional values, and what do those people also believe in? Gun ownership. So you're gonna go around and stab someone who doesn't buy into your delusion. You know what you're doing? You're bringing a knife to a gunfight. I mean, it depends on the person, but if you pull a knife out, I'm not pulling my knife out. I don't feel like being in the Pirates of Caribbean and having a little knife battle with you. No, I got shit to do. So you're gonna have a nine pointed at your face. Not to be like overly dramatic or anything, can we just start stabbing transphobes at this point? 
Like, we have such a big problem of transphobic people being fucking idiots and not getting their shit kicked in. Can we just start kicking their shit? Now, I am a little bit confused by this because you're saying they're not getting their shit kicked in but then you're saying you want to stab us as well so are you trying to like beat us up or are you trying to stab us because either way personally what i carry every day i have three options before i go to my gun three so if you're just coming at me with your hands i got something for that if you're coming at me with i don't know pepper spray i got something for that if you're coming at me with a knife definitely have something for that if you're coming at me with a gun let's get into a gunfight, man or woman or I don't know. I don't know. I, I just don't understand this. People do not respond well to this. Like, do you think people who don't want to buy into your delusion are like, yeah, you know what? He's totally right. Uh, when I see them again, I'm going to ask them to stab me. For everyone, every, the entire world would be so much better if we could just stab a transphobe. People are tired of hearing about this. They're tired. So let me give everyone who's in this community a suggestion. You are not tougher than us. That's a fact. You don't have more people than us. If one of you comes up and tries to stab somebody in a, I don't know, Starbucks, there's gonna be probably five people who are like, dude, what the f are you doing? And yes, even in a Starbucks. Next, we don't care. It's your business. If you want to hang fishing lures off your glasses, like you've never been fishing in your life and that it's a fashion symbol, that's your problem. But don't involve us. Is that fair? <laughs> Thank you.